Hello, fans of the Switch! My name is Vincent, I am on the main cast for the Switch, and I am really, really excited to announce today uh, the actress who is going to be playing Sue. Woo! Uh, what's your name? I'm Nyla Rose, and I am happy to be your new Sue. Yay! Uh, so my first question is, tell us about your audition for the Switch. What was going through your head during the process? To be perfectly honest, through the entire process, uh, the, the phrase of no way, no effing it's way is happening. Yeah. I, I just couldn't believe it. Um, when I originally saw the notice, it, I was on Tumblr goofing off, and mm. it pops up, you know, oh, they're in Canada, there's no <laughs> way on earth. And I just kind of ignored it and yeah. went back to, you know, putting around on the internet. And maybe two, three weeks later, it pops up again. So I'm thinking, you know what, maybe... It's fate. Nah, what the hey. So I, I sent the email. <laughs> exactly. So I sent the email, and, and I got a reply, and it, it, it just... Everything happened so fast. Uh, you know, I, I sent in my um, my audition tapes and got some feedback, and I was like, oh, my God, like, these are real people. They're actually, like... Yeah, this yeah. Is, this is really happening, and... It was unbelievable, and it, it still hasn't sunk in yet, but slowly each day, like, sitting here with you is like, oh, my God, oh, my God, this is real. This is real. Yeah, that was, like, the exact same experience I went through. It was like, no way, no way. So I know. <laughs> it's, am it's amazing, right? Absolutely. Yeah. So my next question is, question two, what is the most exciting slash challenging part about joining the Switch, or what do you see as might be the most exciting or the most challenging um, for me, I think the um, most exciting part has yet to come, mm -hmm. um, and I think that's not going to happen until the, the, as you're probably, you know, well-versed and know of, the, the magic when all the cast gets together, when, when that just, it's, it's organic and it's just created out of nowhere, but it's that love and just that family that a cast really, when they really gel, so by you guys being all the way in Vancouver oh. and me being all the way in Washington, D.C., we're missing part of the family. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Third question. You are a pro wrestler, which when I, like, I, I saw your tapes and then someone was like, yeah, she's a pro wrestler. And I was like, really? That is so cool. And I've, I've actually, I went on YouTube, like, I was a bit creepy and watched your, uh, your wrestling <laughs> matches. It's so cool. So you're a wrestler. You've been on tour. Do you have any great stories for being on tour? stories so so my, my personal favorite story it happened recently um, we were on tour we were up in Connecticut and it's one of those moments that I'm sure everybody has when you just look up and you're like why don't I have a reality show I just need cameras on me all the time yeah because me another wrestler decided without you know completely unbeknownst to each other we decided to prank each other at the exact same time so <laughs> I sneak off down to his room, you know, and I knock, his roommate lets me in. He is downstairs in the lobby, unbeknownst to me, you know, plotting against me. <laughs> I, I was like, oh, great, he's not here, awesome. So I take his stuff, and I duct tape it to the ceiling. Oh so God. after, you know, yeah. you can imagine it's quite a process. I go back down to my room thinking, ha you know, oh, I got him good. <laughs> and that footage is nowhere to be found. I am having a private freak-out moment. So I right. go out, and I find, like, a little trail of clues, you know, like, some of my luggage, and then, you know, like, notes and stuff. So I kind of piece it together. Right. I follow this trail of clues, <laughs> like, like, on James Bond or something. It leads down to the swimming pool, and he had to fix my luggage to one of the little rescue floaty rafts oh my in God. the middle of the pool. Oh, my God. So here God. it is, like, late at night. I have no choice but to get in the pool, oh. the deep end, to get my stuff. So it was, it was well played. We both got each other good. That's hilarious. I bet when you came back to your room, you're like, this is karma for me duct taping. Like someone stole my stuff and this is karma for me duct taping his stuff to the ceiling, right? <laughs> I felt about three percent back. Oh, yeah, right? <laughs> oh. All right. So because you're a wrestler and because you have a lot of experience in all things fighting, uh, who would win in a fight, Sue or the Mighty Thor? 
tough question. There's some factors you didn't you didn't factor in here. Are we are we talking about hot, sexy Chris Hemsworth Thor? <laughs> or are we talking about the new lady Thor? Um you know, I didn't think about that, and I think the Lady Thor is a great one. I, I was okay. reading articles about it, and I was like, they're coming out with Lady Thor. They should make a movie. Like, that would be amazing. I agree. Yeah. Full 63 Thor. Okay. Yeah. So we got a women's match. We got, yeah. got Sue versus Lady Thor. Yeah. <laughs> um, to be honest, and, and I feel a little bit bad saying this, but I think Thor is going to get the upper hand in the beginning. But just the beginning, because Sue, Sue's got a brain on her, and she's crafty. Mm -hmm. She's quick, and she's crafty. And I, I just, I know in my heart, she's going to get the upper hand at the end, and Thor will not see it coming. So the brain is a greater weapon than the hammer. Absolutely. <laughs> the, the brain is going to overcome the brawn, and then they're going to be best of friends, and they're going to go out for, you know, sushi after. Yeah, <laughs> they're going to get where we fought. That's great. <laughs> Um, in the Switch, Sue has a nerdy side to her personality. And since you're playing Sue, I was wondering, is there a side of your personality? Are you nerdy or obsessed about something? Absolutely. Mm. Absolutely. I, I, little known fact about me, I once won the science fair in, like, oh. I want to say fifth grade. I won first and second place in the same science fair. I don't even know if that's, like, possible, but I did it. Yeah. What, what was your project? Uh, it was on acid rain. That's awesome. <laughs> um, but I definitely have a nerdy slash geeky side. Uh, it's a, it branches out in many facets, but I think it's really focused in comics and video games. Mm -hmm. So I, I don't know if anybody can see behind me over here. I call it the museum. We have uh, <laughs> Nintendo with Legend of Zelda in it, of course. Oh, that was the <laughs> only game I played as a kid. <laughs> you got to. You got to. Yeah. It's a part of, you know, your heritage. You got to bring it up. Yeah. <laughs> we got Nintendo, Dreamcast, Atari, all that's in the museum. That's, that's me. That's who I am. Gamer. That is amazing. All right. Thank you so much, Nyla, for answering all my silly questions and being silly with me. Because um, that's what we're going to be doing on the Switch. Um, <laughs> and you. since you pranked your... Uh, your co-wrestler if you ever want to prank someone on set we should put our brains oh, yeah, together happening. that's happening it's happening okay um last thing is there anything that you want to say to our fans before you go and before we start shooting shooting the switch um i just look forward to doing an amazing job for you guys and just entertaining you and and i look forward to being part of the switch family and we're going to put out a great show a great series and I look forward. Please feel free to message me and hit me up. I want to interact with you guys. And just thank you for letting me be a part of this. It means so much to me. Oh, thank you. Thank you for joining our team. We're like, I'm so excited. This is going to be awesome. <laughs> Yay. All right. Thank you so much, Nyla, for talking with me today and uh, introducing yourself to our fans. Oh, it's been a pleasure. Great. <laughs> Bye. Bye.